Today, we're taking a journey to the heart of our planet, diving deep into the mysteries of Earth's core. Without needing the imagination of Jules Verne, we're going to uncover the great secrets lying at the center of our world. Let's get started. At the center of our Earth lies a colossal metal sphere, seemingly unreachable. This is Earth's core, made of iron and nickel. This core generates a magnetic field that protects our planet from harmful radiation and allows life to flourish. But how exactly this magnetic field is created, and whether it's the same on other planets, remains significant significant question. New research is revealing more about planetary cores and magnetic fields than ever before. Earth has a solid inner core approximately 1,000 to 100 kilometers in diameter, surrounded by a liquid outer core of molten iron extending another 2,000 to 100 kilometers. This circulating liquid metal generates Earth's magnetic field. Scientists have conducted fascinating experiments using a liquid metal called Galinston to simulate the formation of a planetary core. By observing the interaction of low and high density water. They studied the convection and turbulence in the outer core. The results are quite exciting. They discovered three ways to enhance the circulation within the liquid iron core. Convection, the rotation of metallic iron in the outer core, a process that occurs as the core cools and solidifies. Tidal forces, the gravitational push and pull from nearby objects, such as Jupiter's magnetic moon. Ganymede, solidification, the formation of solid iron crystals in the liquid outer core. Driving circulation, which planets generate their magnetic fields using which methods is still unknown. However, a European spacecraft launched in April 2023 and set to reach Jupiter in 2031 might give us some answers. It will enter Ganymede's orbit, potentially helping us understand how similar worlds create their magnetic fields. The EU-funded CORSAT project uses three European space agency satellites to study changes in Earth's magnetic field. Earth's magnetic field can strengthen or weaken, even reversing the magnetic poles, a phenomenon thought to occur every few hundred thousand years. One technique involves observing the upper atmosphere and auroras at the poles to identify clearer signatures of changes in the core's magnetic field. These changes are most pronounced in the South Atlantic region. Off the coast of South America, Earth's magnetic field weakens by more than 50%. Known as the South Atlantic Anomaly, the cause of this phenomenon is not fully understood. Projects like CORSAT provide more information. At the core mantle boundary beneath the anomaly, the magnetic field appears to reverse. This might be a sign of weather like systems in the outer core, caused by temperature differences and the planet's rotation. However, these vortices move at much slower speeds, about 20 km per year, compared to the 250 km per hour wind speeds in hurricanes. If you want more information on science and space, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. See you in the next video.